Good morning, Mangan. Welcome to the last episode of Star Time for this week. I'm still with TK. TK, what's your purpose on it? My purpose is to be powerful. I've, I've got so much power within me, I've got so much ability within me, and I've got, I've got an ability to reach out and to, and to touch people. And, and, and in some way, if, if I wake up in the morning, one of the things I strive to do, regardless of what I'm pursuing, is, is whoever I meet for the first time, make, make an impression on them. And, and hopefully have a positive impact, whether it's a stranger or, or someone I'm, I'm looking to strike up a business relationship with. That, that first impression really makes a difference. Uh, and I think if, if I carry on on those principles, I can use that power then not only to be able to achieve what it is I'm setting out to do, but at the same time have a positive impact on those around me. And in your life, uh, has there been um, and in your life has there been a time where things were just not going your way? Uh, you had to pull things out of somewhere uh, to make life come to reality. Um, what did you go through, and how did you come back strong? Okay, uh, from from, from a, a family situation, had a d difficult emotional circumstances, mm -hmm. having to deal with certain uh, paternal issues and and, and the like, and. And you need to you need to to grow up and, and make peace with certain sure. things in your life that happen, not because of any uh, malice towards you, but mm. it was just things that involve certain people that mm. you couldn't control. Mm. And 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 what I found is, I mean, earlier earlier this year, last year, at some point, from an emotional personal perspective, it was it was it was pretty dark and pretty bleak and. Sure. And I needed to to lift myself, mm. find that motivation, and and having good friends like uh, my mother, for instance, she's mm. a very good friend of mine. She's just more than that, mm. uh, and she was able to to tap into something within me mm. that that awoken that desire to to get out of that hole, mm. and 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 of course reminding myself that you know this is not the end sure, sure. and 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 realizing that in life you get certain challenges but you never get a challenge that's too big for you okay. and 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 that's how i got okay. i got through that yeah i mean we've got um grade 11 and 12 uh, studying uh, in the back of their mind they're not sure if they'll have enough funds to go to varsity the following year and uh, they're in this dark mm. hole what can you say to them as a as, as a word of motivation you know, as for, for whatever career path you want to follow, if you believe in what you want to do and you go out there and you look for it, there's always someone there waiting for you to back you. Sure. There's, and, and you just have to believe in yourself. Mm. Don't lose sight of, of what your end goal is mm. and go for it. And, and I remember an anecdote, uh, one of those tightrope walkers, uh, they were asked, how come is it that I mean, you, you so, you're so high above, above the ground but you never fall off the rope. And the guy said, well, if I just keep looking at where I want to get to, I'll never fall. But once I start looking mm. below me and what's happening, I start worrying about balance and the like, mm. and that's when I lose focus. So just keep focused. You will get challenges in life. Mm. Those challenges are there to build you and to strengthen you. And, and, and you will overcome them if you really believe it. Mm. And, 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 and the, but as I was saying again, if, if you know what you want, go for it. There's, there's always someone out there who's yeah. waiting to back you up. TK, thanks a lot for those wise words. Angana, that's it from us. Till next week. Ciao. Adios.